Hi everyone, look what GB Colleen got. This is the mini brand's mini convenience store. Uh, you can't find this at Target, I didn't see it at Walmart, but I did find it online on Amazon. It did take a while to arrive, but you finally got it. And in this video, we're gonna open it, build it, and then also see what mystery exclusive mini is inside. Okay, just like with the mini marts, it seems like we have a lot of packages. Let's just get them out and start organizing them. Okay, so here are all the packages. We have here the stickers. It looks to me like it's they're trying to make almost uh, like a 7-Eleven store or a, like, like a gas station convenience store. All right, these should probably be the instructions, which is interesting. We have like a booklet for the mini marts. There's actually a huge piece of paper that it's folded. And then, you know, th that's where you have all the instructions. But for this one, it seems like we have a booklet. It honestly looks nicer like this than than the mini mart. So I don't know why they didn't do same thing with the mini mart, especially because it's more expensive. This uh, convenience store goes for, I think, 15 bucks on Amazon. And I think the mini marts are around 30 or so. Pretty sure we don't need that yet. Trying to get the, the plates. Yep, here we have the plates. We're going to start with these. And guys, as a reminder, when you're putting the plates together, see you have letter A over here. And then if you pay attention, you will have letter A over here. So you just put those two together. That's how you figure out where the plates go. Same with these green thingies that go on the side. You have letter G here and then you have letter G over there. So it goes over here. These two go over here on the side. Next, the instructions tells us to build the storefront. So we're gonna do that. I'm pretty sure it's in here because this is the next largest one. Yep, there it is. All right, this is done. Let's keep moving. Okay, these are the two pieces. I'm guessing on top of them, we will have the slushy machine, maybe the the thing that keeps the food warm. Whoops. Okay, that's not good. Okay, let's see what we got in here. I don't know, but let's build it and find out. And this one has a sticker right here. All right, this one is done. Let's move on to the next one. All done with the microwave. Looks pretty cool actually, right? Not bad. Simple, but, but pretty cool. Okay, this is something I never understood, even with the Mini Mart. I don't know why sometimes there's pieces that should probably belong to a different bag, but they're they're in this bag. I mean, there's not much we can do with this. Hmm, never mind, there is. Okay, this is the <laughs> this is the cash register. So disregard all that. Let's put the stickers on first.
Okay, let's see what else we got in here. And this is our Slurpee machine. I don't know where this part is from, but I guess we're gonna find out eventually. Let's build the basket real quick. We're just gonna skip over this. Okay, the basket is done. The only difference between this basket and your regular basket is the handles. They are green to, I guess, match the, the convenience store. This seems to be like the freezer or the fridge section. By the way, if you enjoyed the video so far, please don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe and click that bell button to get notified whenever I post a new video. And let me know in the comments if you even heard about this mini brand's convenience store or if you already have one. Okay, all done. This looks really neat. I think out of all of them, I like this one the most. Oh, before we move on, let's see what exclusive mini do we get inside. Okay, I guess they <laughs> didn't go deep enough. Let's cut it over here. And we have the Jolly Rancher Hard Candy. Um. Is this even part of... Is this part of series 1? No, is this part of series 2 or 3? Let's check it out. Okay, so I looked over at these and I'm not seeing anything that shows, you know, that there's a Jolly Rancher Hard Candy, the blue package. We do have this one, orange with blue, or we have the, the Jolly Rancher watermelon that's green. But unless I'm missing something, there does it doesn't seem to be any um, any mini any Jolly Rancher blue package anywhere. So we can see the package over here, but it's absolutely nowhere on the collector's guide. So I guess I got I got a one of a kind mini. Hmm, interesting. Then again, it's kind of weird. I mean, if it's not part of the collection, I don't know. I like having it, but at the same time, it's like, where am I going to put it if I complete the collection and make a display case? Where do I put this, you know? Anywho. And now for the hardest part, these are the shelves and we're going to build this and then, yeah, see what's next. Yeah, I'm separating them here on the side because I don't want to lose time just looking through this. I think that will make our lives a lot easier. I know it might seem easy in the video, you know, building one of these, but it's actually pretty hard. I know there's so many different parts and different pieces to keep, you know, track of. I felt the same with the other Mini Mart, the, the Series 3 Mini Mart, but um, this is not as bad, you know, because it's a smaller one, but still, they're, they're pretty hard to build. This one is tricky. For some reason, I can't get it right. I mean, not that I got the other ones perfect, but this one... I don't know what's wrong with it, but... Look, okay. <laughs> okay, that's better.
Okay, so we have two types of shelves. We have this one um, that has this piece over here. So this goes at the bottom and then you have this one. So two of these will go on the upper part. See, just like this. All these four will be kind of like tied together and back to back. So we need to make sure that the shelves are actually at the same level. Okay, now that we got all of them assembled, let's put them together. Here we have it. And again, it might seem a little bit flimsy, but trust me, once we snap this into the plates, it will stay put. Okay, so this is another piece of shelf that will go here on the side. So let's build it real quick. All right, and here it is. Oh, we almost forgot. We can also make this one, which is the coffee thingy. Okay, this should be pointing down. Now for the stickers. That looks really nice, right? Look at that. We have assembled every single piece. Now it's time to put everything together. And last but not least, this part. So there you have it guys. This is the Mini Brands Mini Convenience Store. It's a lot smaller than your regular Mini Mart, but I think this one is way better. That's my personal opinion. I think it's a pretty cool piece. I'm not sure why you can't find this at Target or at Walmart and it's only on Amazon for now. I'm not going to put any Mini Brands in this right now, but I will probably do it in a future video, maybe in a short because it's not enough to do a full video of me just adding mini brands to the convenience store. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. It really helps my channel and also gets this video in front of other people that are passionate about mini brands. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also click the notifications bell so you will get notified whenever I post a new video. And last but not least, let me know what you think about this convenience store. Do you like it or do you prefer the mini mart? Are you going to purchase one of these? I want your honest opinion about this in the comment section. I'm really looking forward to reading all your comments. Stay golden until the next time. Bye bye.